Welcome to the uh, Windows Computer and Technology channel, and we're going to talk about VPN. Somebody asked me a question about that. He saw some of my old videos talking about uh, virtual private networks, what they are, and he's read a lot of things, and of course there's a lot going on. So I've seen a video of a guy saying, hey, don't use VPNs, they're snooping on you, and he wants to know if it's true, and um, basically, um, you know, why would we use a VPN, basically, uh, at, at the start? So, first of all, um, let's just say what is a VPN. A VPN is a virtual private network. It is something that you will subscribe to in a form. It either is a free or it could be paid. And there's going to be a big difference in one or the other, and that's where we're going to talk about it a little later in the video. Why would you use a VPN? A virtual private network has a big advantage. It encrypts all the data from your internet connection to the other uh, computer where you're connecting to to view content. So that's one of the first features, which means if you actually um, install and use a VPN, what's going to happen is that your internet service provider cannot see what you're doing anymore. So that's the first thing. It, it does not see what you're doing because it's encrypted. It can... Um, somebody uh, told me once, they said, well, you know, the same is true about browsing and HTTPS, they're the secure. Uh, in some way, yes, but not totally. The difference is that a HTTPS connection, yes, your ISP doesn't see what you're doing on that connection, but your internet service provider knows which website you visited. Where in a VPN, your internet service provider will only see the VPN connection. It knows you're actually connecting to a specific place, but it doesn't know what connections you're doing inside there. So if you go to visit websites, your ISP only sees VPN website, the VPN connection. It doesn't see the websites you visit while using the VPN, and everything gets encrypted. So it doesn't know where you're going. Um, and of course, the other advantage, and a lot of use this uh, for that purpose, is that you can actually fake it so that your connection is from another country. Meaning that if you want to see content that is unavailable, uh, for example, here in Canada, a lot of content from the US is not available. When you go to some of the websites like PBS website or you know some of the news websites you would go to, uh, CBS, NBC, and so on, uh, it's going to tell you, well, you're not in our, you know, you're not in the zone where we offer this uh, content. So what you could do is use a VPN, and in the VPN, you can select, um, I'm in the United States somewhere. So the website is going to think you're a U.S. citizen suddenly because of that. So that is also another way of kind of fooling websites into thinking where you are um, is is different than the reality, basically. Now, what about the snooping part? They're snooping on you. Well, yes and no. And yes, they are. No, they're not. What do you mean? Yes, they are if you're using a free VPN. For the most part, a lot of them actually use that connection to either push ads or do um, you know, some form of monetization with what your content, what you're doing. And so, yes, FreeVPN has a tendency uh, to probably snoop on what you're doing. And that is why we always say free VPNs should be avoided all the time. Uh, free VPNs also are, on, in general, much slower than you know, paid VPNs and um, not necessarily offer you all that you need. A paid VPN... In general, it doesn't mean because it's paid that it's not going to snoop, but the big, you know, well-known VPNs, uh, the ones that are really rated, highly rated, those don't snoop on you. And actually, even many of them have the, um, 
the ability and actually they tell you that everything you do is not logged, which means that technically if law enforcement, for example, would like to know where you went uh, or a government agency, well, they're going to answer back. We don't know because we don't have the logs of any of the connections that we have or our users here. So these are the best VPNs, the ones that really they don't log what you do and they don't snoop on what you're doing. They just give you a tunnel that you go through and connect to other computers. So um, that's why we often say, well, a paid VPN is the best way to go because the free ones are not the same and might even log what you're doing. So yes, they could snoop on you, but the real good ones do not. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.